Hi, this is Z from Z Ranch 123 with another video of USB port repairs. This one is the MZ609 and here is the port now reinforced with Loctite chip bonder. This was a particularly tough repair because it had the port come off twice and the customer sent it to us after uh, they tried to repair it and uh, we repaired it this is the insides of uh, the MZ609 it's a nice tablet except for the USB port is surface mount and this is the Achilles heel of uh, another tablet with uh, lifting off USB ports that's the back cover held on by hex screws there you can see and uh, so we reinforced the port, put it back together. However, after we put the motherboard back in, we found that this unit had secondary issues. The secondary issues we'll go into in a second were that this is the motherboard put back together. You can see it's uh, there's the HDMI port, and next to it is the USB port now plugged in. After we put it all back together we found out because of the amount of time that the port had been loose and the surges that the motherboard was damaged. It would no longer charge the circuit. So uh, here you can see our fix and this was a tough one. Here's our uh, tiny add-on circuit. It's a lithium-ion charge circuit that uh, we put in there and that charge circuit uh, basically bypasses the motherboard and charges the battery on its own. So with a lot of tablets we're seeing today, uh, the motherboard has damage issues and we can repair it by bypassing the motherboard and charging it directly like you see. So that's getting the USB 5 volts through the wire wrap wires going directly into the battery and delivering 3.7 volts regulated into the battery um, basically lowering the voltage from 5 to 3.7 and here you have the device now charging in line uh, ammeter with 3.7 volts delivered at uh, 0 0.58 uh, amps there we go 0 0.57 amps being drawn into the USB port the unit is now charging and is fully charged uh, even though the motherboard is damaged. And this is a twofold repair. One, a uh, Loctite chip bonder to repair the USB port, a uh, new USB port. And then in addition, uh, there was um, the really tough, tiny add-on board to uh, get uh, the lithium ion to charge. We do this every day. If you need help with this type of repair, the URL is below. And please do get hold of us. And thank you for looking at this video. Hopefully it has helped you in this repair.